So, every special card is back in packs, and we have a bunch of packs to open, starting off with an 82 plus times 100. If you guys want cheap, fast, and reliable foot coins, check out u7buy.com. There is a link in the description down below. And make sure to use the code HABER to get yourself 6% off all of your purchases. Pretty much all the highest rated cards are back in packs. We've got all the footies back in packs. We've got all the amazing team of the seasons back in packs. 82 times 100. Can we get a bunch of footies, EA, please? Here we go. Team of the season from Colombia. There's no way Munoz is my highest rated tots in this pack. That is horrific. From an 82 times 100. All right, there better be shapeshifters, footies, everything, man. There better be everything. Come on. Please. That's not a great start at all, is it? That is a terrible start. 32 dupes. Okay. What have we got at the back? We did get a footies. We got two footies. We got Insigne and we got Diego Carlos. But that's about it. Honestly, that's kind of mid. I don't think that's amazing. I think that's kind of mid. Um, I really expected a lot more from that, to be honest. So there's an SBC to get an 85 plus player pick as well. It's really easy. I think it's a bronze squad. I thought that was Pele for a second. Socrates, though, will take it. 95, not bad. I honestly thought that was Pele. I got very excited. I don't know why. I just saw Shapeshifter Brazil. It was a little bit bright as well. That's my bad. That's on me. All right. 85 times 10. Come on, EA. Be better. Be better than my 82 times 100, to be honest. Who is it, who's it going to be? Messi? Almada. Mm, 93. I feel like... I feel like Pagway's got a bit worse. Eh? I mean, Captain V is not bad, actually. Captain V is pretty good. Oh, look at all those golds, though. Look at all those. So, any of these that had special cards before that don't now? No, okay, they don't. They were all gold before. But that's actually not a bad pack. Cap de Vier at the back there absolutely saved that pack. But, yeah, I was just thinking, like, that 82 times 100, we went from getting, like, two pages of tots now to all those golds. It's kind of rough, isn't it? Casemiro, of course, is still really common, as he was every week that he was in packs. Eh, I mean, it's not bad for an 85 times 5. All right, next 285 plus player pick. Let's see what we get here. Oh, that's a shame. Unfortunately, already got him. But Nicolas Pepe for a 93 would have been all right from a bronze squad. you got to remember, they're bronze squads. So it doesn't really matter if you get, like, not the most desirable player in the world. Getting a high-rated fodder card is decent from a bronze squad. Uh, a couple of packs here to open, though. Um, hopefully, fingers crossed, there's some uh, some good footies in here. Ronaldo's back in packs. Messi's back in packs. Neymar and Mbappe, I think, are back in packs as well. EA are a bit weird, though, because, like, it's supposed to be really, like, every special card, but, like, some cards aren't in packs as well. Bruno Fernandes' Shapeshifter is no longer in packs. Apparently, Haaland's no longer in packs. So, it's, like, some cards are in packs, and then some cards get left out at this time of year, and I don't really know why. It's always really weird to me. But, as a United fan, I'm kinda, I was kind of hoping to get Bruno Shapeshifter, to be honest. Ooh, walk out. Maybe a Dangler? No. Okay, that is bad. It's only a double 83 plus, to be fair. Yeah, Busquets is not back in packs either. So I don't know I don't know really why certain players get put in and why certain players don't get put in. But yeah. Uh, Jordi Alba and Savic from the little stip, skip pack glitch. I need to figure out how to do that. I still don't actually know how to do it. Um, all right. 85 times 10. Go on. Let's see a Dangler Ronaldo EA. Come on. Let's see a Dangler Ronaldo. Sui. It's going to be another Al Nasser player, which means Ronaldo's at the back, right? Sadly, not yet. No Tots Kimmich, so we know that as well. No Tots Moments Fekir. Um, Insigne, eh, it's meh. All right, I have no idea what this is because I don't speak Norwegian. But he said discard the dupes. Eh. Eh, we'll take, we'll take Cavani, I guess, because he's, uh, he's got the little crown, which means he can link to anyone, right? Um, so we'll take Cavani. He said discard the dupes. So we will discard the dupes, even if it's painful, all right? Just because... That's what he wants. So, what have we got? Oh, my word. Bunch of packs to open. Uh, where are people getting these packs from, by the way? Uh, 85 times 10 first. This might be the free one. I'm not sure. This might be the free 85 times 10 that we get for logging in today. Because everyone gets a free 85 times 10 for logging in. It's going to be uh, Marino, but really it's what we want at the end of the pack. That's interesting. Ooh, wow. Two 95 rated footies. I always don't want to discard them. That can get you an 85 times 10 pretty easily. All right, 85 times 5 now for Alex after he submitted his uh, he submitted his two pinks that he got in his 85 times 10. Let's see if this is better. Fingers crossed, we hope. 
I feel like, yeah, I don't know why, but packs almost feel worse now than they were before. And, like, better cards should be in packs, theoretically. 93 Balde, at least he's still in packs. You get him a lot. Raquel May and Depay. I mean, it's not bad for an 85 times 5, to be fair, is it? Alright, I've got my 85 player pick now. I'll take it. Sadly, Mertens' is footies card's not in packs, and his tots is. I don't get it. Like, there's going to be some very confusing players in packs. But I've got an 83 double and an 85 times 10. We'll open both of these up and see what we get. Team of the season, the 83 double. Let's go. Mbappe. I'll take it. Mbappe. Let's go. We get ourselves Mbappe. He's a cam for some reason. And he's flexing his muscles. But it's fine. You know what? It's okay. 85 times 10 now. Come on, EA. Show us the love right here. I want to see Ronaldo at the back of the pack. Please, man. That's all I want to see. Give us a footies Ronaldo. I might open packs all week until I get Ronaldo, to be honest. Okay, so Lamella's backing packs, Enzo Fernandez is backing packs as well for some reason. Why? But then Tots Ferrati's out of packs. What? I'm I'm just so confused, man. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys are opening 84 or 85 times tens right now and not getting special cards because I'm hearing a lot of people right now are not getting specials in their packs, which is a bit of an L for me, eh? Like I don't understand why we're going backwards. It's later in the game cycle, and we're getting less players in packs and stuff. Just doesn't make sense to me. Don't get me wrong. I'm quite happy getting some of these golds just because I didn't have golds in the club. But it's still annoying. Like, you need to be able to re-rinse the packs. All right, we go again. Come on, EA. All I want is Ronaldo. Please. I'm glad I saved my 85 times 10s from yesterday. It's weird that they reset at midnight. Lower. Okay. Nice. For some reason, Torch Lower wasn't in packs. Before, even before his footies, and now he's in packs again. I don't get that. But we get ourselves Tots Lau, which is good. We'll take that. Jo why is Joe Cole in packs, EA? Why is... Why is Trophy Times Joe Cole still in packs, all right? And then we don't have, like, actual good cards in packs. It makes no sense. All right, couple player picks now. What are we saying? Wow, an 83 plus player pick. That's just so appealing. War a, war an amazing player pick that is, man. Are you joking, EA? One of 285 plus, though. Okay, we'll take Carl Toko Akambe. At least he's 92 rated. That's, you know, it's fodder at the end of the day. Level up, though. 99 KDB, fourth slot. Calling it right now. Hey, Renato Sanchez in the fourth slot. Basically the same thing. Like, both amazing midfielders. That's very close. 85 times 10 now. Quirty club name. What are we saying? Let's get a team of the season and footies danglers, please. Brazil, left wing, never Vinicius Jr. is Gabriel Martinelli. 93 rated. At least it's a toss. Ooh, Futty's Royce though, 97. That's very nice, actually. That's good, man. Futty's Royce in there is absolutely solid. Mares, no shapeshifter impact is really weird. Don't know why, but that's solid. More content, EA. More content. Player pick first. One of two 85 plus spiller. Tamori's easy choice there. Easy choice for Tamori. We'll take it. Thank you very much, EA. All right, come on. 85 times 10 now, please. Sort us out. Sort us out. Oh, it's Kudus, right? 90? Man, packs have gone backwards, bro. Packs have actually gone backwards. Oh, he got Sancho as well. No. The dupe. That's so good as well. That's unfortunate. All right, we go again. I've just opened a mixed players pack because I'm stupid. What is wrong with me? Silver? No way. Who have we got? Layuni! Let's go, dude. We've got Layuni, Dagestal, and Busk. Nice. War a pack, that is. The dream. All right, 85 times 10. EA, foot oh, is Footy's Rashford in packs? I just realized Footy's Rashford might still be, might be back in packs. If he is, I want him, please, EA. I, I, I ignore Ronaldo. I'd like, I'd like Rashford, please, EA. Hey, two footies in one pack. So Kimmich and Hernandez are no longer in packs. Brilliant. That's awesome. All right, we go again with another 85 times 10. Of course. I can't believe there's only three weeks until FC24 is out. It just seems like to have gone so quickly. I don't know. Like FIFA 23 seems to have absolutely flown by. Ooh, Carver, how? I feel like getting a lot more footies now. Even though like the overall spectrum of special cards is probably a bit lower. Like I feel getting a lot more footies. All right. 85 times 10 for Dylan. He's got a few of them, actually. So let's see if we can get something good. Messi? Almada again. Brilliant. 93. Okay. Maybe a dangler. 
Uh, pink. Three! Three in one pack! Look at that, man. Three footies in one pack is kind of crazy, I can't lie. Quick question for the comments of the video, actually. If Saudi offer Liverpool 200 million for Mo Salah, do you think Liverpool should accept it or not? In my opinion, I think they should accept it. I think I think it's like the Coutinho deal all over again. I think they could use that money to genuinely add to their squad to make it a title challenging squad again. That's what I think. But obviously they would be a little bit in the mud for about 6 months. But 200 mil is crazy. They were, I think I think they should accept it. I don't think they'd ever get an offer like that for Salah again after this year. But let me know in the comments down below what you guys think anyway. That pack was not awful. Liverpool have already got like a good amount of attackers. I think they've got enough attackers to try to like basically scrape by until January. And then in January, they could obviously sign someone to replace Salah. That's unfortunate. More duplicates. That's just my opinion. But then again, like, I don't know. Salah's not worth 200 million at all. If you're Liverpool, you have to take it. I, I, like, I just think a player of Salah's age, yes, he's unreal unbelievable player right but a player of salah's age now i feel like when you get an offer like that on a player that's not exactly declining he's still performing at a really top level i feel like you accept it and then you try and build a younger squad again liverpool's team was unreal the team that won the premier league the the ucl got to i think two more ucl finals and came runners up in the premier league unbelievable team but it's fair to say that team is not unbelievable now i feel like it might be time to cash in and try and rebuild an unbelievable team again. Next 35 times 10 for Dylan. We also have the leaked Manchester United ratings for FC24 Ultimate Team, which I'm going to show in the video as well. Let me know what you think down below. I think we've actually been... I think it's been pretty fair from EA. I think that entire top line is pretty fair. Uh, I'm actually quite surprised Varane got an upgrade. I thought he'd stay at 84, but we'll take it. Oh, Nana at 85, I'm quite happy with. Lissandra, 84, I'm quite happy with. I thought Luke Shaw maybe could have been 84. I thought Luke Shaw had a really good good year, in my opinion, but I'm a biased Man United fan. Sancho, 82, I think is fair enough. He was, yeah, yet again. Like, he just had three very declining years. Oh, wow, he opened the pack without us watching, and he got he got Alvarez. Wow, GG, that's a big pull. Um, the only ones I think are a little bit... So, I, I think Mount's fair. I think Martial is fair. I thought wan should have been, like, 82, in my opinion. Uh, but he got a downgrade, didn't he? I thought wan was one of our best players last year. I thought wan and uh, Luke Shaw, I thought, maybe should have been higher rated than what they were, in my opinion. I thought I thought 84 and 82 would have been fair. But I'm, I'm biased as well. Apart from that, yeah, I'm, I'm quite happy with those ratings, to be honest. I think we've done pretty well. I think, we've been, I think EA have been pretty fair and to United, to be honest. All right, cheeky little level up player pick for Dylan as well. What are we saying? Rough. Ferran Torre is probably the best option there, right? Uh, that's 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 pretty poor, unfortunately. All right, come on. EA, Ronaldo. Give us footies, Ronaldo. Give us a footies, Ronaldo, EA. All right, Kudus, very nice. Uh, whatever. These, I can't lie, packs have been a bit boring today, in my opinion. They've actually been kind of boring. I feel like, yeah, I don't know. EA should have just thrown every single special card in packs. Because, like, all the footies are basically back in packs. So, EA should have just thrown every special card in packs, in my opinion. I think that would have been way better. But, you know. Oh, finally! We actually get a Vinicius. That has been... So the amount of Brazilian left-wingers... It doesn't even matter at this stage of the game because he had a better footies card for free. But the amount of the amount of left-wingers from Brazil, Davidsons and Martinelli's that I've packed over the last few weeks, hoping for... Oh, team of the year. Wait, what? Nice. Hakimi, team of the year. Um, so, yeah, it's nice to have finally got... A Vinicius there. Oh, why is Footy's a Kotcha not in packs? EA? Why is Tots Haaland and Donnarumma not in packs? Oh, wait. Donner yeah, why is 99 Donnarumma not in packs? Oh, EA. You're just confusing. Whatever, man. Whatever. All right, I've got my level up player pick since EA fixed them. I'm hoping for like a 99 KDB, a 97 Varane, something like that would be very nice. Um, let's see what we get. This is not the compensation one. This is just since they fixed them. Do you know what? 95 Enzo or 96 Cavani. I'm leaning towards Cavani as a United fan, but I am going to take Enzo just because I think that card's actually still pretty pretty usable, to be honest. All right, Super Elite Pack. We're going to open it up. Um, this is before 6 p.m., so it'll be at the end of the video. Um, so if you see any players that aren't in packs after 6 p.m., that's why, you know. Uh, Tadic on the front is actually not great. 
That's not an amazing start, to be honest. Ooh, uh, I need fodder, man. I'm actually running low on fodder. I've done a lot of player pick SPCs recently and not too many packs, so the fodder is appreciated. I mean, it's not it's not awful for fodder, actually. For fodder, that's all right. And then we have three 95 rated icons there as well we can go and throw into an SPC. So I'll actually take that. I've accidentally opened up my 385 times 10. What have we got? Grimaldo. All right, come on. Dangler footies, please. Dangler footies. Oh. Oh, my word. That's a bad 85 times 10. For I mean, it's for free, but it's still bad. Oh, wow. 